Hi everyone, my name is Dimitri and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm trying something totally new and I'm going to be cooking for you guys. Today I'll be making some pan fried dumplings. So let's get started. This is Cooking While Quarantined. Currently it is April 2020 and a lot of people are stuck in the house because of the COVID-19 outbreak. So that means a lot of us have to cook more. On this Cooking While Quarantine series, I'm just going to show you a few simple things that I enjoy to make that are just really easy. And if you're not much of a cook, you could easily make. The first step in cooking is to wash your hands, which I know you guys are already doing frequently because we're in the middle of a pandemic right now. Now these are the items you'll need to make some pan fried dumplings. First. A pan with a lid, a pair of tongs, one third cup of water. Now, I know this may seem like under one third cup of water, but this measuring cup is like a little ratchet and I don't I don't think the measurements on it are exactly correct. Yeah, that's the premier brand of measuring cup, right? Olive oil. Now you could use olive oil, avocado oil, vegetable oil, canola oil. Honestly, it really doesn't matter. Just use whatever oil you have. These dumplings are Trader Joe brand. They, you can get them in pork, shrimp, vegetable. Honestly, they all taste great. And yes, before you guys drag me, I know I am cooking dumplings out of a bag, but I'm just showing you quick quarantine meals that you can make on the go. Now that we have all of our ingredients, let's get started. Now the first thing you're going to do is put some oil in the pan and then you're going to heat the pan to medium, medium high. Once it gets more heated, you want the pan as coated evenly as possible. If I move the pan around more than normal, the burners on this stove, like, you can't really see it, but they're not really even. If your burner is more even, you don't have to move it around as much as I do. You want to make sure the pan is as evenly coated as possible. Once the pan is nice and warm, you're going to start adding your dumplings. You will hear them sizzle a little, but that's fine. Now we're just gonna fry these dumplings until the bottom of the dumplings is like a nice brown color. Right now they're not ready yet. Once the dumplings are nice and brown on the bottom like this, now we're gonna add the water. So you're gonna add the water, put a, lid on it, put a lid on it, and then you're gonna reduce the heat. You want it to reduce the heat to low or like a one or a two or a three, depending on how, how strong your stove is. Now you wanna try your best not to let the heat out until they're done, but if you, if you let it out, it'll still be okay. You can still cook them right. Now these are nice and done, as you can see, they're like that sticky texture. Like that's what you want. Like on the top, you want this like nice done sticky texture. Now you're just gonna use the tongs, grab them, put, put them on a plate. I'll try to make this as pretty for you guys as possible, but don't get excited. Y'all know this ain't the Food Network. Look at that. Next, we're gonna pour out the dumpling sauce. Now let's try them. Ah, hot, hot, ah. Mm, so good. Mm, so good. And that's it. Now you have some fresh hot dumplings. If you enjoyed this episode of Cooking While Quarantine, please pound that like button and pound that subscribe button. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I can't wait to see you guys on the next episode of Cooking While Quarantine.